Hey guys, it's Cut Caleb bringing you a first vlog. Uh, this is actually what I look like for anyone who doesn't know me and who just randomly found me. Um, I'm going to be doing these videos of like vlogs, I guess, maybe rant videos, I don't know. I'm going to be doing these with my gaming videos. I would like to have a healthy balance of both, but I don't know, sometimes I'm just like, I just want to upload random stuff, I guess. So you'll be seeing different stuff on my channel. But I'm really excited because I have 463 views, which that might not seem like a lot to some people and most YouTubers out there, but, you know, this is something that I really want to do and pursue as, you know, a career and make videos and just keep, like, growing this and making it really enjoyable because the whole reason I started this was, one, because I like games, and two, because in a way it was to help make people laugh because that's one of the things I love and I think that's really why I uh not to sound conceited but I like having a lot of friends and like hanging out with people because I'm always trying to get someone to laugh whether it's by saying something really weird or maybe doing something that they don't expect me to do but all in all I just want to make people laugh because you know I still kind of getting I'm, I'm getting over it but in the past, I've had a lot of, like, depression and stuff like that. And I'm not trying to play, like, the whole what was me card. I really don't want you to feel sorry for me in any way. It's just something I've gone through for some of my life. And in any, no way, shape, or form do I want you to feel bad for me. I mean, it's life. Stuff happens. It's just on how I handled it at the time. And I started writing poetry... And then I kind of came across people who made these gaming videos, and I was like, you know what, this is pretty cool. I like what they do, so I want to make people laugh. I want to make them, you know, smile and brighten their day. So that's actually why I started this. And then I started making some of the gaming videos like you saw, and I, I enjoy it. I really do. And hopefully I can get some editing stuff. That way I can make videos better and kind of, you know, shorten them, I guess, and just cut to the funny points but I still like making the long videos because it's something I enjoy watching in my free time I enjoy like the long videos that because I sometimes just want something to occupy my time and there might not be anything on TV or I might just not want to play a game so I watch people play games and either get ideas or just laugh and have a good time so that's really why I make my videos long um, but I would like the editing to get better at that so I can kind of make it prettier for you guys too as well and yeah so that's actually why I started doing this and that's why I'm going to keep doing it and I also want to do videos like these because I'm going to be doing videos like this of just randomly news updates or stuff I hear in the news or maybe just a topic I want to like talk about like maybe the new Xbox One or maybe it could be some random homeless guy I saw punching a midget just anything that comes to my mind, I would like to talk about it in these videos because some of the feedback I got was people enjoyed like uh, my racial one, the one where I talk about black people having juicy lips, and also the sexual desires one got a lot of views. People said that one was just, you know, it, it was decent, which I can understand. I want to make the videos better and funnier and flow a little bit better, but I think the, the big deal on me doing it in this format of you seeing my face and everything is to eliminate the whole distraction of the game itself so you're not focused on two things you're not focused on what's he doing in the game wait what's he doing or what's he saying sorry my bad um because some of the people who don't necessarily play games have a hard time focusing on both and so i got that feedback so i figured you know what why not just record my face and do that? And, of course, I'll be recording at random moments of just stuff I'm doing, and I'll hopefully upload it the same day I record it, because I don't think it should take that long. But, who knows? I might record longer videos of this, too. I don't intend on recording, like, 30-minute videos of me face-to-face -face with you. No offense. I mean, you're gorgeous and all. And I love what you did with your hair today, but... Just all in all, I think that would be like too long unless it's going to be with multiple people in kind of like a podcast format, but not really, I guess. Just you seeing me talk with my friends and how we interact. 
but even that would have to be like a set down schedule of like a certain topic we're going to talk about that's big, whether it be like a new game that came out or something that's really like impactful. But I highly doubt that'll happen. But who knows? You know, time changes. My plans might change. I might do something like that. But this will be to kind of like be a funny thing and also in a way a therapy because. Like I said, you know, I just really want to help people and I want to talk about topics that make people laugh or that can reach someone or, you know, just be all around in what I put on my channel. And I think hopefully that will take me far, showing my diversity of, you know, I'll produce the funny, I'll produce the serious, I'll produce the blah, 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 you know, rambling on. But yeah, I'm really excited for me putting these videos out because... I'm going to, of course, keep putting gaming videos out, but I'm going to put videos out of me doing this quite a bit, too. And I think in my free time, I might do this just out of sheer boredom. So you might see a lot of these videos pop up, too. And I'm really hoping they'll be good and they go the way I hope because I never really, like, script anything out. I just kind of go with the flow. Like when I did, you know, talking about black people is... I literally had nothing in front of me. I just started talking randomly about black people and have they have blue, bleh, they have juicy lips and they like juicy watermelon and they wear juicy on their pants. That just kind of all just came to my head and that's why it didn't sound as like fluid as it could have. But why I think I enjoyed it was because it wasn't planned and I wasn't going into it praying it would be funny like I thought. I just spoke the way I normally do when I rant about stuff. And people seem to like that. I'm not going to say everyone does because sometimes it's just weird or sometimes it's stupid. So I won't say that all of them are definitely going to be like, you're going to laugh so hard, you piss. But... I, I will hope that you will find them enjoyable or entertaining and keep your attention. And, yeah. But, uh, on a side note, on just, I guess, random news update with, like, my life, something really most of you are going to think is dumb. I am so excited for Chris Calico's new album, Son of Sam. Um... If anyone likes strange music, you guys should check them out. Uh, he just came out with a new song yesterday called Scars. Really, really amazing track with Tech 9 um, If you guys get a chance, you should listen to it. I've been posting about it on Facebook and texting some of my friends, telling them to watch it because it's a really good video. You check it out on their channel, Strange Music Inc. Um, please do that because strange music has been there for me so much of my life. And I listen to the music religiously every day. And I'm really, like, excited for his new album, uh, Tech Nine's album, Something Else. It was truly something else. Um, it was a great album. It had somewhat of, like, a rock theme in the beginning, but then it kind of, like, mellowed out to, like, somewhat R&B, but it still kept the rap feel. He expanded on some different genres, and... I, I was really happy with what he did with it, so please check out his album. Uh, Chris Calico, of course, his songs are just sounding really out there, and the beats are just so unique in how they sound, and his singing voice is just spot on that I enjoy listening to it, so I'm really excited for his album. Uh, I pre-ordered it, so I'll get a signed copy and a t-shirt, and I'll probably post a video when... I get it, showing it to you guys, and I'll probably be wearing the shirt, and I probably would have already listened to the album, so I'll tell you my thoughts on it, even though most of you might not care, I don't care, it's amazing, Strange Music rocks, and yeah, so expect to see more of these videos and some of the rant ones, and I'm planning on doing something with my friends Connor and Ashley, starting like a little series called Two Beans and a Cracker, where we kind of talk about random topics. And so if you see me talk about something on here and then in a video with them, you don't have to worry because it's you'll hear it from my perspective. I 
mine might change and or I might just want to give wholeheartedly my side on this so hopefully that works out soon and I can start recording with them we tried to the other day but it didn't work out or I shouldn't say the other day the other week but it didn't work out like we planned because Connor and Ashley got tired and so they went to sleep but yeah I have quite a few game stuff that I have stockpiled up that I'm gonna start slowly releasing if I can remember to because I always seem to keep recording but keep forgetting to upload because I'm always like well uploading takes so long let's just make more videos but I need to start uploading some of these videos because some of them I like some of them I just thought were really weird and what happened in the game so I hope I can get those out soon uh, expect to see more of these videos of me talking to the camera and I really hope you guys enjoy this and until next time see ya